DCTC. <laughs> Starting with Kathy. <laughs> Starting with me. You're going away. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Chris, we're, we're very excited about your new job, but we're very sad that you're going, and I've already talked to you about this, but... <laughs> Who will get us tickets from now on? I, I don't know what to do. It's going to be crazy. And, you know. and who will announce all our life events to the whole world? <laughs> But we know you'll do great, and we will come visit you. Seriously, Chris, thank you. You're yes, amazing. Yes, you're awesome. And for caring so much. Thank you, thank you. And we for liking you. our husbands. Yeah. I know how we're going out on this one. Can I have a job? Yes. <laughs> hey, Chris. We are going to miss you. We're going to miss your enthusiasm, your loyalty, and your wonderful hard work over the years. I'm going to miss you, miss you personally as well. But we wish you all the best in your new job. Hi, Chris. Look, um... We'll miss you so much around here. I don't know how we're going to continue without you. Uh, and I mean that. I really mean that. You're a good man. And uh, a real important part of our company. John, how do you think that uh, what, what role Chris has had connecting the company with the community? I think you are personally responsible for lowering, maybe even obliterating, the wall that existed between the community and the Denver Center Theater Company. You, all by yourself, by your personality and your energy and your charm and warmth, you reached out and you made that connection. And uh, we benefit just about every day from that experience and that work that you did. So thanks, man. Thank you, John. It starts from the inside Heartbeat, heartbeat Your rhythm's inside you Heartbeat, heartbeat Every Chris, oh my gosh, I can't believe you're leaving. There'll be so many people that'll miss you because you're kind of the face of the Denver Center in the lobby. Have a great time. What a great, exciting, new opportunity. Chris, uh, there's so many things I have to thank you for, but probably most importantly, um, it's helping Janine and I get together. When uh, I finally decided that I would ask Janine to marry me, um, I had one small problem in that I had no idea what her ring size was because she doesn't have any jewelry that I could steal and then take to a store. And the person who had been so uh, enthusiastic about the potential for the two of us to be together while we'd been here doing 1001 had been Chris. Of course. So yeah. I called Mr. Weaker <laughs> and I said to Chris, would you mind terribly sneaking down to the costume shop and pulling Janine's uh, measurements out for me and then letting me know what her ring size is? And he was thrilled to find out that that was going to happen. He was more than happy to go down to the costume shop and he did exactly that. And I was able to put a ring on her finger and have it fit the first time, thanks to Chris. Wow. So he is as near and dear to me uh, as everybody else in, in, at the Denver Center family is, and we will miss him. Like, truly. Awesome. Thanks, Thank you. Thanks, Drew. Of course. Hi, Chris. Saying hello from Louisville, Kentucky, and I just heard the amazing news. Congratulations. And I just want to say that when I think of Denver Center Theater Company, I think of you. You're the first person I think of. You were the warmest, most amazing advocate for actors I have ever met. I will miss you tremendously. I will visit you at your new theater. And every time I look at this, I will think of you and that other guy who, who gave me the ring. Okay, see you soon. Hi, Chris. You are one of my favorite people here at the Denver Center, and I'm so sorry to see you go, but I'm so incredibly excited for you and your new adventure. We wish you luck. McKella wishes you luck. 
Max wishes you luck. Thank you for always welcoming us here to Denver so positively and, and making it our home too. So I will uh, see you next time in your new gig. Chris Rieger, bye, but you're only going to Lone Tree, so I'll see you soon. And remember me, because I'm nearby. You can come over for dinner as long as we're still friends. Hi, Chris. I'm sorry that you're going to be leaving us, but I'm so pleased that you're going to something so amazing. Uh, you've always been so important to me here. Uh, you've always been the most cheerful human being alive. Uh, I just want to tell you I'll miss you, and I love you. Thanks. Goodbye, Chris. To say we're going to miss you is an understatement. God knows how many things you have done for us and for Norma, for Stories on Stage, and for all of us getting tickets for us for innumerable shows. We'll miss you a lot. Have a great time, and I'm sure you'll be very successful there. Thanks, Randy. I, I, okay. I just want to say, Chris, thank you. Thank you for the years of getting my family nice seats when they came in at the last minute. Thank you for greeting them at the door and making everybody feel special, including my, my ancient parents. And we're going to miss you. A giant heart is leaving Denver Center Theater Company. Audiences will miss you. Chris, or uh, his Uyghurness, as Lyle would refer to you, we are going to miss you so much at the Denver Center. The hallways and the lobby will not be the same without your enthusiasm and welcoming presence, but we wish you all the best of luck on your new adventure. Hi Chris, it's Michelle. Congratulations on your new job. I think it's going to be fantastic, but you will be so missed at Denver Center Theater. Love and kisses and mazel tov from your New York humble playwright. Mwah. Hi Chris. Hi, Chris! We just wanted to say, um, well I wanted to say thank you very, very much for um, many years of wonderful service. I've never met a more loyal, dedicated person in all my life. We're going to miss you, but congratulations. I know you're on to bigger and better things, and congratulations, and we'll see you around town. Hi Chris! <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I think it's a great new job for you, and all the best to you, and the Denver Center will miss you, and I'll miss seeing you, but I know that you will be very happy in your position, so congratulations. Hi Chris, you have been a wonderful partner in crime on the PR side of things and you've taught me so much about this market and this state and I'm so lucky to know you. So um, we, we will miss you very much and Lone Tree is so lucky to have you. Chris Baker, we're going to miss you here at the Denver Center um, and I will absolutely miss you saying, didn't you just love it? <laughs> it's true. It wasn't every show that they did the best show that they've it ever done? It was the best show ever. <laughs> and I want you to know that when they start doing shows at Lone Tree, they are going to be the best shows ever. center of anyone there is. Chris, we're really going to miss you. You've been the face of the theater. It's great to have you around. We wish you all the best and can't wait to see you back here again. Thank you guys. Hi Chris, um, you welcomed me here 10 years ago with open arms and you've kept them open the whole time and you are going to be so missed here, but go. Chris Weger. Um, what I have to say to you is that uh, now that you won't be at the center in your official capacity of the last many years, uh, despite the fact that there will be so many familiar faces and so many friends uh, here, uh, it will be impossible for the center to feel as welcoming as it has all these last years that you have been here. Uh, it will never quite attain that level of warmth and welcome again. And for that, I am sorry, but I wish you the very, very best in your uh, new adventures and uh, I think I have a new reason to go out to the suburbs. Hey Chris, we're gonna miss you. Here's a big kiss for you. Good luck. Chris, goodbye. Godspeed. Good luck. 